CM Punk's highly anticipated WWE comeback has kicked off with some dramatic flair, notably featuring Seth Rollins flipping off the returning star at the conclusion of the Survivor Series Premium Live event. Clarifying any confusion, wrestling expert Dave Meltzer has set the record straight, asserting that Seth Rollins' actions were all scripted and part of a meticulously planned storyline involving CM Punk. The Survivor Series, War Games climaxed with CM Punk's long-awaited return to WWE. As the victorious faces from the men's match gathered in the ring, Punk's music hit, prompting a mix of surprise and ire. The world heavyweight champion, visibly infuriated, hurled verbal abuse at Punk, who basked in the adoration of the crowd on the ramp. Despite initial appearances, it turns out that Seth Rollins' seemingly genuine reaction to Punk's return was, in fact, a carefully orchestrated element of the planned angle. As disclosed by Dave Meltzer on the Wrestling Observer Radio, every move made by Seth Rollins in response to Punk's arrival was a deliberate part of the storyline, ensuring that the WWE Universe is in for an intriguing chapter in this unfolding drama. As far as the Seth thing goes, that was all an angle. That was 100% angle, revealed Meltzer. The concrete details of creative plans for CM Punk, the voice of the voiceless, are poised to be revealed with his reported first Raw appearance in the upcoming episode. CM Punk remains a prominent figure frequently discussed in interviews with various wrestling stars. During a recent media interaction with Seth Rollins, the visionary was questioned about the controversial star. Initially, Rollins referred to Punk as a cancer and issued a caution for him to stay away from WWE. Despite Rollins' advice, the former AEW world champion has chosen not to heed the warning, and WWE sees potential in utilizing these comments to construct a compelling storyline. It is playing off the fact that months ago, when somebody asked Seth Rollins, you know, he's a cancer, we don't want him, which later, by the way, he said that if the company wants him, and it's the right thing, and he doesn't have a problem with it. But because he made that statement, they figured they could do a shoot angle with that, and it makes sense, added Meltzer. As the Royal Rumble approaches, do you envision the showdown between Rollins and Punk taking center stage at this prestigious event? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. And if you are new to the channel make sure to hit that subscribe button and click on the bell icon for more interesting content like this in future. Till then see you all in the next one. Thanks!